Good day and welcome to South Africa's rich and famous. And in other news, Something Soweto has finally broken his silence about the controversy surrounding his work. In a series of ex posts, he addressed DJ Maporis' claims that he was given masters to his previous album, ICPTPT. Something Soweto said he had little confidence in his music selling without DJ Maporisa as a producer and clarified that Pori didn't produce his work. The truth is, I had very little confidence in my music selling without him as a producer. Seemed as if you, my audience, loved the idea of him being a super producer, and I was not going to go against that, so I lied. He didn't produce my work. I worked with Mass Music and Gapsa the Small in that studio, who produced between 40% to 60% of my work, depending on how you view it. Maporisa shouldn't lie the way he does. It's going to get him into trouble one day. I paid Pori for my masters. I paid an amount he asked for at the time. Furthermore, I lied about Pori's contributions onto my project. He didn't produce anything, he said. Something sort of claims that people he has worked with over the years have used his music without permission, contracts, or consent. He also claimed that they released his work without informing him of release dates and discredited him on social media when he asks what's happening. This after he shot up the trends after he was not credited on the song Amalanga Awafani. Something so it said he preferred to keep quiet about the matter as he was solving it behind closed doors. For more stories like these, kindly do keep subscribing to our YouTube channel at South Africa's Rich and Famous.